Hey there, in this video I'll teach you how to use World Painter by Captain Chaos. The download link is in the description and specifically I'll show you how to make an island with features similar to the ones I've used in my map. So here's the map I've made. As you can see it has many different features including a mountainous area, a fjord, beaches, cliffs, an inlet, a big plain, and, um, and so I'll show you how to make such an island. So if you, if you go to create new world, uh, this, this is just how big you want it to be. Um, these two options allow you to choose if you want the sea floor to be hilly or flat. And to create an endless ocean, you want the water level above the ground level. So this, the higher this level, the deeper your ocean. And you can choose the surface material, just go with grass. So this will give you a hilly sea floor. So the first thing you want to do is create a landmass in the middle of the ocean. So click the height tool and just hold left click and this will raise the sea floor. And you can change using the scroll wheel change how much you want to raise at one time. So we've got our island forming here. The next thing you want to do because no one likes a place where you can't build. So if you want a flat surface use the flatten tool and this will flatten the ground to the height of which your cursor is at. And this is also useful for creating cliffs as if you flatten the seafloor and push it in to the landmass create a nice drop off into the sea. So that's pretty basic um, and you can color the terrain or change the what the surface material is made of by clicking one of these you have a few options rock, bedrock, sand, you name it so to create a beach yeah I'll show you how to create a beach, so use this tool smooth smooth don't really know how to describe it it, it um, creates a gradual contour of terrain so it makes it smooth, a smooth transition in height. And so yeah, you want to smooth that out, maybe flatten flatten it a little bit, create a little alcove, and just paint it with sand. And you have a nice little beach for yourself. So we got a little island, a little alcove, a little beach. Next thing you want to do, plant trees. So click the deciduous, generate a deciduous forest and just paint around. A little dark green shows where trees will form. And uh, that's pretty much the basics of creating your own island. You can play with all the tools yourself and uh, you can populate caverns if you want. So this will be underground dungeons which will be created. I don't really use that for my maps. I like to create my own. So to save the world, file, export world. And to make sure there's an endless ocean, click water or level at and then that should be the level that you set uh, the water level to be in the first place and just press export and this was the result this tutorial was pretty basic so if you want me to do any more videos about how to generate any specific features let me know and if you want to see more development hit the subscribe button and I'll see you next time